What up, though? Heist man, the folk talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Hey, big dog. Big shout out to Lou Castro, but that ain't the big dog we talking about today, man. The big dog we talking about today is Jay Prince. You know when you go to the movies and they say silence is golden, and that's exactly what happened when Jay Prince met up with Kanye West. He straight son, dude. He had him up under the wing, man. Come on. Y'all know what I'm talking about. It's an ongoing beef between Drake and Kanye West. And he's, he had to apologize. He got up there and apologized. And Jay Prince was just standing there looking like OG, super gangster, all that, man. I'm talking about, yo, I ain't seen nobody get pressed that hard since Matt Hoffa did Louis the 13th. Come on, man. Kanye West, if you in trouble, blink. <laughs> The good thing about it, man, Drake and Kanye West, after the apology, they, they're supposed to hit the stage together and, um, you know, do something to get Larry Hoover home. Um, man, that's wild, but y'all know what I'm talking about. If, if y'all have seen that, man, Kanye was up there apologizing, holding it, reading it. J. Prince standing up. He ain't make no mean face. Like, man, you know, if you mess with Drake, J. Prince coming at you. And, hey, that's how it went down. Y'all seen it. Kanye West up there apologizing. Reading off a script, Jay Prince ain't said a word, ain't shook his head. Mm. Like I said, Kanye, if you in trouble, blink. Kanye was blinking. Anyway, we definitely going to be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live talking about stuff just like this every Friday. Y'all got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pimping that I'm putting out when I put it out. And like I said, I go live every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through and holler at your boy, Heist Man Defoe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions. Peace.